If you spent a bit of time in Python, you're probably familiar with the zip function. In this case here, it's taking this list and this string, it'll basically pair 10 with A, 20 with B, and so on and so forth. So running this here, we can see it gives a list of tuples where they're paired together nicely. However, if one of those is longer than the other, it effectively ignores them, so it's going to stop at the shortest iterable. However, suppose, for example, you wanted to still make this zip, but put in some default values, then we can use the zip longest function from the iter tools module. But I can now replace zip with a call to zip longest. Let's remove list and we'll try iterating over this new object. So we can see this time here where we have the E and the F, it's actually going to replace those with a value of none. We can also replace none with a value of our choice using the fill value parameter. Running it again this time, we should see that those missing values here are now going to be replaced with a fill value of 100.